Good day everyone, Complaining Gamer here. I'd like to try and address the AMD CPU GPU performance issues in Simu 1.11.3 to the best of my ability. You may have noticed that there is very little reporting about AMD on this channel. Now the reason for that is very very simple. I don't own any AMD products so how can I demo it for you when I don't actually have the products? So all of the information I have is hearsay and third party through the community. So what I've done is I've gone over to Reddit and basically asked the community to tell me their personal experience. The first thing that you need to do if you are an AMD CPU GPU user is go over to the Reddit thread and look at all of the different information provided by the community. There's over a hundred comments and some of them go into great, great detail and perhaps it will specifically help you with your exact hardware. If I try and condense it all down into a very simple form, there's a few ways that we can look at this. Basically, there's a few different combinations that do and don't work. Let's go back a little bit. Simu 1.11.3 introduced multi-core support. Prior to that, the focus was single core performance. Now we have Intel and we have AMD. Intel has always had superior single core performance to AMD and that statement stands true today. Uh, I believe even the best Ryzen CPU that's available has moderate single core performance, not incredibly impressive single core performance. Even though we now have multi-core support, you still have the issue of the single core performance that still will play a huge part within CMU. Intel is the superior CPU in that sense. Let's look at the different combinations of the problems that you're having. We have AMD GPUs and Nvidia GPUs. CMU uses OpenGL. AMD famously has extremely poor OpenGL driver support. Now, what some users have done to circumvent this problem is play on Linux because the Linux drivers are superior for OpenGL when it comes to performance in CMU compared to what AMD provide. The problem that AMD GPU users are having is that the OpenGL support is terrible. This is once again where Nvidia do a better job. But let's look at the different combinations. We have moderate to poor single core performance, which is key, and very poor OpenGL driver support. So AMD is limited already in many different aspects compared to Intel and Nvidia. I'm jumping around a little bit. Let's look at the different combinations that do and don't work. So for example, if you have a modern Intel CPU and an average uh, Nvidia GPU, this combination is perfect. And of course, the more you increase each of those, the better performance you will get. So if you have a i7700K with a Nvidia 1080 Ti, well, your performance is going to be outstanding. Now, let's start to play with these combinations a little bit. If you have an Intel CPU and an AMD GPU, your performance should be acceptable. Not great, but acceptable. If you have an AMD CPU with an Nvidia GPU, for example, the Ryzen 5 1600 and a GTX 1060, you should see fairly good performance. On the other hand, the majority of FX processor users are having a subpar experience. Now, the ultimate kick in the lower region is the AMD CPU with the AMD GPU. That combination has been absolutely disastrous for most CMU users. But we could perhaps develop the metrics of a variety of different elements that lead to your performance. So of course we have to consider CPU, GPU, RAM, hard drive, all of these different elements can play a key part in the end result. Especially things like RAM frequency is very much ignored, but it does have a role to play. There's too many details and too many hardware variations to cover exactly your specific issue. So what you need to do once again go over to the reddit thread and just go through it read every comment and see what can and can't be learned like i say my limitation is that i don't have any amd hardware hopefully i was able to address some of the points 
simply, quickly and effectively to give you an idea about what's going on for you AMD users out there. Now, as we stand today, what is the solution? There doesn't seem to be one. Simu doesn't have DirectX support. Simu doesn't have Vulkan support. That's potentially coming in the future. When? We don't know. AMD has very poor OpenGL support and there's been no sign from AMD that that's going to change. So what options do you AMD users have? Honestly, it's not great. You can try and play on Linux. Now, people have reported that when you do that, your performance has been similar to AM to NVIDIA users. Alternatively, change your hardware. I know that's a bitter pill to swallow, but it's just the facts and the reality. Alternatively, you can accept your 15 to 25 FPS in Breath of the Wild, or you can kind of try other games. Um, most users have reported that if they play something like Mario Kart, Eight or Super Mario World, they get much better performance. Now, this is because Breath of the Wild is particularly demanding. So, that's all I've got to say for now, people, on the AMD CPU, GPU issues and the different combinations and the different hardware possibilities. Go over to the Reddit thread. If this video was helpful, thumbs up. If it wasn't, thumbs down. And if you want to see more content from me, The Complaining Gamer, why not subscribe?